Callie Russomano is with us here on the John Mandola Show via West Grants and Girls Soccer. Uh, Callie, let's talk about uh, your role on the team. Where do you play and what do you try to do to le be a leader on the team? There's always going to be somebody better than you. And they just, sometimes they don't understand that. But we try to tell them as much as we can. Like Yasmin being captain, Ashlyn being captain. And they're good captains, Paola. They're all really good captains. Six freshmen uh, starting sometimes. So there's a, a youth movement. Talk about uh, trying to be a good influence for some of those players. Show them what they're doing wrong, honestly. Like, like if they kick the ball the wrong way, I'll teach, I'll teach them how to re-kick it. Or like, there are some girls that came and didn't even know how to play. So like, we just did like conditionings over the summer and some girls came, some girls didn't. Some girls came to practices and then ended up not sticking with it because they couldn't do it, they thought they couldn't do it. There's girls on the team that will be out on the field crying that they can't do it. And like, I just tell them like, you. Stop putting yourself down about it. You're always trying to build people yeah. up. Let's talk about your family. You got a big family. Yeah, I am the oldest out of five. Nice. I, I live with my mom and my grandma. My uncle was the coach, the assistant coach with Cook, and so like he's like kind of a big like role model in my life. That's the word. And um, so like I started because he was the coach, and my siblings aren't very athletic they don't want to do anything they just like to sit on electronics I try to get like my sister wants to do like soccer my brother wants to do soccer but they just won't leave the house to do it so I try to get them to but I try talk about your goals going forward what you want to do with your life uh, and head to college maybe in the Poconos well Ashlyn's my best friend she's the captain her brother goes there and he talks a lot about like how he likes it and he's going for teaching and I want to go for teaching so I was thinking that'd be a good school and they have a good soccer team. Any teachers that have influenced you whether it was grade school or high school? Um, Michelle Cole she was my science teacher and she's like my best friend and Mrs. Barada they're like my mothers at school they're always keeping me out of trouble making sure that I'm doing good as far as uh, Coach Cook, talk about him trying to get the most out of everybody and trying to have a successful season. Well, Cook is a really good coach. He's honestly like family to me. I didn't even know he was the coach before I came to the school. And then I seen it and I was like, oh, well, then it's going to be a good year. He's always trying to help. He tries to help the freshmen more so that they know what they're doing. And I understand that a lot. And he's always trying to correct what we're doing wrong. Like, and he works on drills a lot more. So it's like we can work on passing the ball and saying names and looking up at who like we're trying to pass it to so we don't pass it to the other team. But he's a really good coach. Well, it's nice to hear your story. We wish you the best for the rest of this season. And of course, uh, good luck in trying to get to ESU. Thank you.